Let's flip it. We got a Bive, brand new Bive yellow fin 120. We're gonna take this baby out to the water today. We're gonna do three videos. The on the water demo, flipping and fishing with this thing. Boom. Hey guys, welcome to another amazing episode of Flipping Kayak with Alex. This is crazy, right? Amazing. I took a vacation day just to do this. Well, it was for something else, but that plan got canceled. Anyways, today we're right here on the water on the brand new Yellowfin 120. Now, this video, it is only possible because of my friend Eric from electricsurfsports.com. I'm gonna link his website down below. He lent me this boat, the Yellowfin 120, for me to do all this crazy kayak demo stuff for you guys. So please, please make sure to go and check his website. He has a lot of awesome underwater toys. The guy is crazy about electric sports on the water. So go check it out, please, and tell him I sent you. If you could tell him, I don't know if you could tell him. But anyways, make sure and go check out his website. I bet you you're gonna find something there that you really like. And no, he didn't pay me for this. Hey guys, low tide. Let's see, it's low tide because normally high tide will be getting here. Over there. Just wanna see how cold the water is. Not that it matters, but it matters. So. You know something, I'm always forgetting something and today is no different. What did I forget today? Well, I forgot my water and my, my cooler, my super awesome earth pack cooler. Which is just amazing cooler and you guys should buy one for yourself. I'm gonna link it down below. I'm gonna put my phone away, it's waterproof but when it gets wet, it doesn't want to charge until it's completely 100% uh, dry. So I don't want to do that. So put it on my trusted earth pack bag. I'm going to put that bag right here on the edge of the boat. Fold it four times. Second strap. Don't want to lose my stuff. Boom, there you go. They say this thing is pretty stable, so that's what we're doing today. We're just testing how stable it is. Uh, I'm gonna stay close to the shore for security reasons, but not too sure. I'm gonna put my glasses on, I wanna see what's up. It's a croc mating season, they say. So we gotta be careful with that. I'm sure there's nothing close I don't see any anything it could be camouflage though well I think I'm in the right spot to flip it first thing first thing I want to do is just gonna walk on this boat oh wow it's surprisingly stable flip or anything I mean water is really oops I was bad all right guys we're gonna see how how good it is just going side to side oh man this sea moved side to side there's a gap right here right there so we move there's a lot of space that it could move that could be annoying when you're paddling but we're gonna test that all right let's see let's see let's see guys let's see all right let's just go side to side look at that man it's i think look so far i just been on it for a minute and it's more stable than the seagulls 130 for sure let's, let's flip it 
Okay. The seats do move. I don't feel that. Oops. Whoa, you see that? I almost flipped. But I want to flip to the other side. So, let's see. All right, guys, so we flip it. See it and you see how much it took? It's a super stable kayak so far. Now, let's see it standing up, how much it takes to flip it. So, I'm just going to stand up like normally. Make sure that you're recording. There you go. Not a big deal. Alright. We see that we could just rock side to side. Not a big problem. We can see that we actually could walk on it. Oh shit! Oh, saw that? Whoa! That's crazy. This thing, it is stable. I think it's more stable than Sea Ghost 130 for sure. All right, guys, so I'm just gonna try to lean and flip it because that's what we're here for, right? So let's see. Let's go ahead. Let's do some more of these. Damn it. Guys! Guys, this thing's stable. For real. Let's just see how much it takes to flip it. Alright guys, we flipped it. Now let's go ahead and put it back up. I'm gonna put this camera here somewhere. Alright, so it's not deep enough, but I'm just gonna show you how you recover this boat. The key here is to push down on this side and grab the other side and just flip it like that. That's all you have to do. It's really, it's really easy to do once you learn how to do it. So just practice. Now, some boats are heavier, bigger. They have drive, they have stuff in the middle that could prevent you from doing that. So that's why you gotta practice. On this Yellowfin 120, it was easy to do. Now, So the Yellowfin 120 only has one sitting position and it's super stable at that position. I was rocking it side to side and it did not flip. Standing up is also crazy. I jump on it, I walked on it and you really have to put pressure on that and hit that point of no return to actually flip the boat. Now they do come with a cover here which I don't have for this boat. Alright guys, so we finished the flipping test and no doubt about it, this boat is far more stable than the Sea Ghost 130. And it's um it's weird because it's not it's actually it's not as long and it's about of the same width, sort of. But um it's more stable. I could I felt good just walking on it. It felt good jumping. You feel you feel more like more stable on this for sure and it is more stable than it goes 130 on my previous videos about this boat people were talking about hey why not just go for the 130 uh no this thing is is good it doesn't have the high sitting position but it has a low sitting position and to tell you the truth 99 percent of the time i'm sitting lower because i don't want to i don't want to risk it i don't want to flip just for flipping you know like it has to be a purpose so hey guys so my friend matt he came up with this new really cool t-shirts awesome colors he has super awesome designs other designs that you can get and i'm gonna link his facebook page down below at least just go out there check it out give it a like maybe you find something that you like for yourself but i feel very comfortable with this on um i just flipped the bow with them and it feels really good like it's drying fast i was gonna change because he sent me two but i decided not to because i feel good it feels really good and i like the colors anyways this boat has a lot of good things and if you want to check the full videos where we go over every inch of this boat i'm gonna link that video here but if you want to know more about yourself if you want to know who you really are you may want to watch this video right here google's gonna select that for you and they know everything about you so i would just click on that anyways see ya let's go fishing <laughs>